Hey there friends, in today's video we are going to be adding an anchor point on a website page here in Squarespace. Super easy, let's do it right now. Okay, so for those of you who don't know, an anchor point is basically a place within a web page that a link can point to, meaning if somebody clicks on a button or if they click on a link, instead of coming directly to the top of a page, it'll jump down to a specific area of the page. It's kind of a great little shortcut. So what I've done here is I've created a very basic website for a nonprofit, and they have this little take action page. So let me show you, if I go over to this take action page, there is a donate button down here on the bottom. And so when people click on that, I want them to come back to this emergency needs page. And instead of coming to the top, I want it to jump down directly here to this giving option. So what we're gonna do is add that anchor point and I'm gonna add it right above this section so that it jumps here. So what we're going to do is actually in the edit function, I'm gonna click on this and we're gonna go into our editing and then I've actually already started the code right here but basically what you're gonna do is you're just gonna come up here and you're going to click on one of these plus buttons and you're gonna just add a new section. So if I click on here, you're gonna come over to this area, scroll down a little bit, and in this more section, there's this little code block. Once you click on that, what you will do is have a little section that looks like this. Let me hit my little edit button, and you'll have a little option to insert some HTML code. So this is the anchor point code that you need to type in. Again, you can see it's the arrow parentheses sign, the P, a space, ID equals, and then quotation marks, and then the name of your anchor point. And this is really important. So this was for a natural disaster donate uh, block, and so that's why it's ND donate, and then you close it with a parentheses. And then you're gonna use the arrow that closes this parentheses, as well as another one slash P, and then another close point. So again, that is the specific code. Remember this anchor point that you decide to name it. Once you have that, click the apply button. Okay, so now we have our code where we want the anchor to jump to. So now we need to go over and we need to program our button to do exactly that. Don't forget to come over here and click on the done section and save. Okay, so now that we have our anchor point, we are going to need to point our donate button to land here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come over here to our take action page. I'm gonna go over to our button and I'm going to click the edit function here and then we're gonna go ahead and click on this button section. Let me click the edit button. And again, this is for a specific button that we want to link there. If you want it to just be a specific link within a paragraph, that you can use that operation as well. So once we have this up, I'm gonna actually go to the link section and this is what you're gonna type in. You're gonna type in the website address. Obviously remember to put the HTTPS in here. Your website main address forward slash the page that you want it to jump to. So in my case, we put that anchor point on the emergency needs page. And then this is important, forward slash the hashtag symbol. And then you're gonna enter that anchor point that you named. And again, this is gonna be your specific name within those parentheses that you inserted. All right, once we do that, if you want it to open up in another window, you can actually click on this and actually slide this. And again, that will open up in another tab or another window on their web browser. I'm gonna keep that closed because I want them to just jump to that specific address. Now, once you have that inputted, you can go ahead and click the done button and we are going to get a really quick refresh and it should be good to go. So now when I click on the Stony button, we should jump right over to that emergency needs page and look at that right over to our donate section. As you can see, if I scroll up, that is the normal home page where it would jump to if you just were going to the page. Again, our anchor point has brought us down to here. Friends, I hope that has helped. Now that's a very specific example, obviously, but you can get creative, use those anchor points. It's a really nice jump around option if you wanna to go to specific areas on a web page. If this has helped, would you guys hit that thumbs up button? And you also might wanna subscribe because we are making a bunch more Squarespace tutorial videos and those will be coming out really soon. Thanks so much for watching.